Perhaps such an effort is required today. The Holocaust was one of the most horrific events in modern history. It was an attempt by the Nazis to wipe out the entire Jewish community in Europe. Prince Charles, who is also attending this event in Jerusalem, said that the lessons of the Holocaust are, quote-unquote, searingly relevant to this day. Our next report gives you a sense of how Jews were persecuted under the reign of Hitler. More than four million men, women and children were scientifically murdered by gassing. Maurice Gluck was three when his parents were deported from Belgium to Auschwitz, a move that tore the family apart. They were taken to the largest death factory in Nazi Germany, a concentration camp where more than one million Jews were murdered. Maurice Gluck lost his mother to the Holocaust. His father barely survived. Maurice was living with a Christian family, the Van de Stocks. He reunited with his father years later. It was one of the most traumatic experiences of his life. In the uh, bath lay a man, very recognizable. <sighs> was more like a skeleton covered with flesh all grey, uh, not unshaven, and uh, with and bald headed. And uh, when when Van der Stock saw me, he said, "Look, Maurice, this is your father." And father wanted to hug me and stretch out these thin arms, and it so frightened me. I just ran away and cried. On 27 January 1945, these Soviet forces were perhaps the first outsiders to witness the horror of Hitler's concentration camps. On that day, about 7,000 prisoners were found alive. Hungry faces with their arms tattooed with registration numbers for identification. These pictures are a grim reminder of the mass murder of Jews under Hitler. During World War II, the Nazis and their allies carried out the genocide of European Jews. Several claims say that some six million Jews were murdered. This was around two-thirds of Europe's Jewish population. Most of the killings happened between 1941 and 1945. But the seeds of the persecution were planted much earlier. When Hitler rose to power as the Chancellor of Germany, his regime built a network of concentration camps. The first targets were political opponents, labelled as undesirable by the Nazis. In March 1933, Germany passed the Enabling Act. This new law gave Hitler the powers to isolate Jews from the society. What followed was the systematic persecution of European Jews. As Hitler's soldiers invaded other European nations, Jewish businesses were ransacked, smashed and set on fire. Places of worship were destroyed. The Nazis terrorized Jews throughout Germany and its territories. Jewish people lost all of their freedoms and rights under Hitler. After Germany invaded Poland, the Nazi forces began segregating Jews with the rest of the population. They were placed in ghettos, away from the rest of the people. What happened next was described by the Nazis as the final solution. Thousands of Jews were moved to concentration camps. Gas chambers were used to murder many of them. Poisonous fumes were released inside sealed rooms to carry out an industrial slaughter. Outside the camps, the Nazis carried out mass shootings. Many others starved to death. The major concentration camps have been turned into museums now. They serve as poignant reminders of some of the darkest hours for humanity. Bureau Report, Beyond World is One.